My name is Olivia. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Makeup Fun with Olivia. Today I thought I'd share with you some of my hand-picked holiday items. Uh, we are all seeing a ton of holiday palettes and sets that we just love. And I personally cannot afford every single one that I want, so I am very picky about the ones that I do buy. Um, I'm looking for quality, functionality, something that I'm really going to use, um, something that I really like, um, and value. Um, I want to get my money's worth. So I thought I'd share with you a couple of items that I've bought during this holiday season or pre-holiday season, but we're full gear in holiday season in makeup land, aren't we? Um, so the first item I'd like to share with you is by Fresh. It's a holiday set and I had always wanted to try Fresh lip balms and they have a little trio for $28 so they're not cheap by any means but I decided to try them out. They do come in a set of three. Like I said, it is a trio. Unfortunately, I don't have the third one anymore because I gave it away. I knew I wouldn't be using it. It's a... Um, well, anyway, let me show you the ones that I do have. So this is what they look like. They are mini sizes, not full size, so they are mini sizes. Um, it has an SPF of 15. They're very, very moisturizing. And one of the things that I like is that they unscrew. Sorry, <laughs> I'm out of my camera here. So they unscrew and then you put it up. Let's see if you can kind of see it. It has, like this one has a little bit of a tint on it. I believe this is the berry lip one. And so it has just enough tint on there that you can wear this, uh, you know, when you're going to Target or something, if you don't want that much makeup, but you do want a lip balm and you want a little bit of color, this is a perfect one to use. The other one that comes in the set is in the brown one see that and this one is clear so it has no color as you can see right here very very moisturizing um, the third one that I gave away is the sugar cherry lip and so the I knew I wouldn't be using a red lip balm so I gave it to my coworker. Um, I hope she's enjoying it if you're watching this hi Karen <laughs> Anyway, so I really love these. They are so moisturizing. They, I mean, the other moisturizer in my favorites was moisturizing, and it still is, but it's very light. This is a thicker moisturizing one. It doesn't feel sticky, or I don't have it on, but um, it doesn't feel sticky, but it is thick, and it stays on for a long time, and it gives you an SPF of 15. I will definitely be repurchasing these in the full size. I love this one in the berry color, and this one with no color that you can put over your lipsticks or under your lipsticks. I've been using this one under my lipstick, so in the morning, I put it on after my shower, and then I take a little bit off right before I'm going to put on my actual lipstick, and it keeps me moisturized the whole day long. I'm not even kidding. These are awesome. So, that's my first holiday the next set. set that I purchased is by Tarte and I had been wanting to try their Amazonian clay blushes for a long time and then they came out with this Tarte pinup girl um, Amazonian clay 12 hour blush palette and it has these two pins on here I'm not going to take them out but you can use them for your hair you can take them out I'm just leaving them on there because I'm not going to use them there I'm going to leave them there for decoration and you press this and it opens up and you have one, two, three, four, five blushes. And this was for, you know what, I'm going to put the price somewhere around here because I can't remember how much this is. But it comes with a, with a mirror and let me see if you can see these close up. They're absolutely beautiful. My two favorites so far are this one and this one. I'll try to swatch them for you. First of um, all, at the, end, the colors are all limited edition, I do believe. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. But this first one is Breathless, Embraced, Whimsy, Bashful, and Irreplaceable. I'm going to do the swatching at the very end so I can show them all to you at uh, the very end. But this one is kind of like a light tan. This is kind of a mauvish one. This is like a pinky, like a light cool pink. Um, this one's a peachy colored one. And 
this the last one is like a medium pink like a peach and pink and mauve all mixed together <laughs> if that makes any sense I'm wearing embraced today you can see it um, they are pretty pigmented um, so use a dual fiber uh, brush I recommend a dual fiber brush because it applies um, a little bit lighter so the next set that I purchased is by one of my favorite brands, Urban Decay. They came out with, it's called, let's see, Full Frontal Lipstick. And it opens up into the set. Let's see if you can see it. It has little mini lipsticks. And I'll show you. It has the color of the lipstick underneath. So this is what the little lipstick looks like. It has the color underneath. It is not a full size. It's a mini lipstick. It opens up like this. This is what they all look like. And I'm not sure, but I think all of these might be limited edition or maybe some of them. Actually, I think a couple of them are and uh, uh, some so of them aren't. A total of six mini lipsticks. They are small. And you also get um, this, what's it called? 24-7 Glide-On Lip Pencil in Ozone, which has no color. It looks like this. You can't really see it. But it has no color. And the idea of this lip pencil is to line the outside of your lips. I honestly haven't tried this yet because I like um, using my own lip pencils and kind of changing the color of the lipstick just a little bit. For example, bit. I like using the Lady Flower color in here, which is kind of like a medium deep rose with just a hint of mauve. And I like using this with a mauvish uh, lip liner. And actually, that's what I'm wearing right now. So it looks lighter here, but I darken them up just a tad bit with the lip liner. Let's see if you can see it. Um, so, Again, I'm going to show yeah. you the swatches of all of the colors, but just so you know what the colors are, they're Lady Flower, Gash, Crush, Liar, F-Bomb, and Illicit. So that is the Urban Decay Full Frontal Lipstick The next lipstick item is set. by MAC Cosmetics. It's a part of their heirloom slash keepsakes collection. And of course, again, you guys know that I'm a sucker for purples. So I got their purples um, keepsake palette set and it comes in this beautiful beautiful little set it has um let me, let me see if i can get closer so you can really see it it is so so pretty i don't know what these are called i'm sure there's a name for it but um i don't know it <laughs> i'm sorry but you open it like this and these are the colors in it um they're so pretty i'm actually wearing them today i don't know if you can see them but um I fell for these right away when I saw them. I wasn't going to get it because I thought I have so many purples. But um, of course, the young lady at the MAC Cosmetics counter um, said, let me try it on you. And she put it on me and I thought, nope, I don't have these purples, so I need them. So I couldn't resist and I bought it. And I'm so glad I did because I've actually done a lot of combinations with these. Um, they're so pretty. Um, I think they're still available. You can go to Nordstrom's. That's where I bought it at the MAC counter in Nordstrom's. They're just so, so pretty. I'll try to put some swatches at the end of the video on this as well. The very last item that I have to share with you is from Bath & Body Works. And um, I don't normally get too many items from Bath & Body Works because I'm very picky about the moisturizers that I use. And I'm not a big candles person. But this year, um, I caved. <laughs> I got two, they have a sale and I think it's still going on right now um, on their holiday candles and on their three wick um, holiday candles and I didn't like a lot of them but I did find two. Their sale by the way is two candles for $22 and normally just one of them is $22. Um, so I purchased two for $22 and I was happy with it. Um, so the first one looks like this. So you can see the, the three wicks. And this one is by Cranberry Pear. It's called Cranberry Pear Bellini. Let's see if you can see that up close. It's a pretty decent size and it smells so good. 
It smells like the perfect combination of cranberries, but not too strong, and pears. So if you like cranberries and pear scents, um, you're going to love this. I'm a big fan of fruity or citric scents, and um, I the love this The second candle one. I purchased, my daughter and I both loved. Um, I have a six-year-old daughter, and so she was sniffing them all with me. It had to be um, approved by both of us. So it is called, the scent is called Tis the Season. And this is what that one looks like. It's the same type of candle. And this one smells very cinnamony. Like it has a little bit of cinnamon and cloves and it just smells like Christmas, but not that strong scent that you sometimes find in candles, uh, Christmas candles, that you can't stand. <laughs> um, so yeah, this, this smelled really good. So if you do like um, holiday candles, Bath & Body Works has a sale going on right now. Two of those for $22, and each additional one that you get after purchasing the first two are $11. So those are my holiday picks um, that I have purchased so far. I would love it if you share with me what your favorite holiday set is right now. If you've purchased one and you've tried it and you love it, please comment down below. Let me know so I can go look for them before they're all gone. Thanks for watching, everyone. Take care. Bye. So this is the Tarte pinup palette, and I'm going to swatch them for you. The first one is called Breathless. It's like a tan color. The second one is called Embrace. And this is like the darker plum. The third one is the cool pink called Whimsy. The fourth one is the peachy one. It's called Bashful. And the fifth one is called Impeccable. The one I was wearing today is this one in today's video, Embraced. Okay, and these are going to be the swatches for the Urban Decay Full Frontal Lipstick Set. Started with Lady Flower. Next one is Crush. Next one is Illicit, and I apologize for the noise you hear. I'm trying to swatch them for you outside in the daylight. That's Illicit. The next one is called Gash. It's probably the darkest one in the set, but still gorgeous. <laughs> Two more to go. Second to the last is Liar, which is probably the more neutral one. Beautiful. Kind of like a little bit of brown in it and a little bit of medium pink, but more neutral than anything. And the very last one is F-Bomb. And there you go.